What we ended up finding was a juvenile mastodon. To the best of our knowledge, just using kind of field IDs, it looks like all the bones belong to one animal and it was found just northeast of Kent City uh, along 22 Mile Road. Now what we're doing, so all the bones have come back to the Grand Rapids Public Museum, to our collection facility, and we've started the process of basically cleaning and stabilizing the bones so, you know, in about a year, year and a half time, they can go on exhibit, be displayed in their full grandeur, and everybody can enjoy it. So we're really just first steps, just washing the sediment or the soil off the bone and then really the long process is slowly drying the bones out. So yeah, so that's the, the lower jaw. Uh, one of the things that makes this skeleton unique is it's a juvenile. So a lot of the mastodons that has previously been studied, many of them by the University of Michigan, are adults. Um, so that that makes this skeleton really unique and you know all the more exciting that you know we get to add it to our collection. It's, it's fantastic how many people are excited about it. I mean I'm really excited about it because you know I'm a curator, I'm, background's paleontology so it doesn't take much to get me excited about a fossil or extinct animal but it's really cool that so many other people are just as excited about it if not more than me.